Moore, executive editor of Texas Fish and Game Magazine here at the 2011 ICAST show in Las Vegas. Wally Marshall, Mr. Crappie. Hey, buddy. You got some kind of trolling contraption that could probably put me on some big crappie. Well, what it is, it's actually a trolling technique, pulling crankbaits. Okay. And so, to really control your crankbaits and get them into the zone, mm -hmm. like when you look on your depth finder, especially on a summertime bite, yes, sir. crappies like to suspend out mm -hmm. over open water. Yes, sir. And so if it's 50 foot deep, 40 foot deep, you look on your depth finder, all the fish is at 15 foot mm -hmm. or 20 foot. I've designed a downrigger for crankbaits. And so actually, we put our rods out the front of the boat, spider rigging, kind of, of a tight spider. line, uh -huh. you know, a tight line straight down. Mm -hmm. And by using the, the crankbait downrigger by bullet weight, actually puts the crankbait right in the zone. So you have a swivel right down here on the bottom of it. This is a uh, three ounce. And so what you do is you tie your main staging right there to the top. Yes, sir. And you can run 10 pound, 12 pound, 15 pound. But on the back, I'm running eight pound, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. So we get more action more on the action crank. Yeah. We drop down there and you see that swivel on the bottom of it. That prevents your crankbait from foul hooking and twisting the line all the way up to the, to the fixture here. You see what I'm saying? Yes, sir. And so if you, we drop them straight down, we use the heavy weight we control to almost two miles an hour, mm -hmm. and still your lines will be straight down and the crankbait will be back here. So I put a four foot staging mm -hmm. on the bottom of the downrigger mm -hmm. and tie my crankbait on. I like to use 100, 200 series crankbaits. We're talking about regular bass crankbaits on these crappie. puppies, you hear me? Yes sir. Because when those crappie are always sitting in the water column looking up and here comes those crankbaits over their head, they're coming straight up to hit that bait. And it's a reaction strike and you go through a school of crappie and crappie fishermen can pull up to 12 to 14 crankbaits at one time. And reason for the downrigger, what is cool, mm -hmm. because if you was long lining with crankbaits behind the boat, say 100 feet, mm -hmm. you can't make a big turn mm -hmm. because sure. all your lines get tangled up. Yes, sir. And so this is a controlled troll. So if I caught it, run through a school of crappie, all my lines are straight down. I can turn around immediately and get right back in them because all of your lines are down with these two and three ounce uh, bullet weight uh, trolling rigs. And so when that comes along there, that crappie cannot stand it, man. I mean, uh, on Grenada, Mississippi and Texas lakes, uh, Lake Levon, especially along the dam, mm -hmm. you do this technique right here, you will wipe the crappie out. I'm into wiping crappie out. <laughs> That's why I'm talking to Mr. Crappie, Wally Marshall, 2011 ICAST.